crazy, guys. If you're young, like, just remember what I'm saying to you because when, as you get older, you give a fuck less, less. about quantity, quantity. It's more about quality. quality and you don't let things hurt you as much. I feel like every month that goes by, I'm, I'm more and more, it's not that deep. Literally, like... We're going to be in the ground one day. I'm sorry, but we are. There's, and there's some, then, there's some serious things that are that deep, like yeah. that people are going through. Yeah. Thank you. Like, oh, my friends t- chatting to someone else that I don't yeah. like, or you know, my friends are going out without me, or all these things are just so not that deep. Literally, we're all. I know it sounds really bleak, but we are going to all be in the ground Why one day. Why are you saying this? Because literally, <laughs> what like, the hell? <laughs> If, don't you start to think like even when you're sitting with your parents like I don't who, like, who are with us a short time every minute is so precious just enjoy it yeah. like I'm really trying to be less of a moody miserable person I just want to enjoy yeah. what I've got enjoy myself now yeah make I mean, the most of it now that's why I got really emotional I was gonna we were gonna talk about mother uh, Mother's Day we I got really emotional on Mother's Day because I don't know, it just hit me. I was looking at my parents and I felt like... Everyone's so old. I could suddenly saw them like in a, like they're older and I just got really emotional. I started crying um, because also my dad, like my, I love my dad so much, but he's sometimes a bit of a he's difficult... Annoying, yeah. He's a bit of a difficult person. I don't, I don't need to go into detail. Uh, I feel like a lot of people will relate to this with parents. And I think even when they get older, it probably gets even worse where you love your parents so much, but you might have a bit of a... Difficult, it might be a bit difficult. Yeah. Um, but you have less patience le- for them or yeah. something, or you know. But it's not that I have less patience for them. That's what it is. Like, because sometimes daddy, he can just come across like sometimes a bit too much, a bit irritating, you know, talks a lot and, you know, very intrusive, trying to interfere with everything. And then you just sometimes feel like, oh, I just need, yeah. you know, I can't be asked for this. I'm older now. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. But like, I had this just... moment where I was looking at him and, yeah. and I felt like, oh my God, I need to have more patience. I need to give him a lot more time and effort. He's, Getting older, I can't even think about it. I'll cry. Yeah. I'm just getting older because I've like, got a limp. He's now. got a limp now. Like my dad used to love walking. I get really sad. Oh. Anyway, yeah, I just thought, yeah, it's really I really upsetting. hate it. So, parents, like, make the most of the time with your parents and like look after them. Like, do find things. You know, listen to them. Yeah, listen to them talk and talk and talk and talk about whatever they want to talk about and let them interfere and let them do everything because. You know they're so precious, they and, and yeah, they've done. They do. So, so they've done so much, like for us I and for you guys. Give more to my dad, unless obviously you have complete toxic asshole parents. Then don't take this advice. Yeah, true. And remove yourself. Don't guilt trip yourself into spending time with them. But we have amazing parents. You know, yeah. touch wood. Luckily, we've got amazing parents. I so, mean, they're not perfect. I don't no, think but, anyone's perfect. I'm not the perfect daughter. You're not the perfect no. daughter. We're not the perfect sisters to each other. Yeah. Actually, I think, we're we're pretty, think we are. We're pretty close. We're, <laughs> close. we're quite close. But you know what? They, I saw this quote and it said, like, be kind to your parents. It's their first time living too. That hit me. Like, the way we look at our parents, I'm like, we expect them to have everything sorted and expect them to have everything, you know, organized, their life, their house, their, you know, their finances, everything. We look at them as if they should have all the answers to this thing called life. But they're just humans too. They're just like us. They're just making mistakes too. Mm, yeah. They're learning too. Especially, I mean, like, Daddy has got really... Look, he has qualities. He's got things that are bad, obviously, yeah? But he went through a life that was really difficult. He lost his mum at the age of, like, four. He yeah. lost his dad as well when I was born... He he's he grew up, you know, running away. If you want to know more about it, I mean, we'll do another episode on their yeah. life story because it's crazy. Running away and leaving his son behind. A lot in Iran, of trauma. A lot of trauma. So, of course, he's going to have some issues. Yeah. But the qualities he has that are good are amazing. Yeah. Like he was the most amazing dad to I me mean, and most Mandy. Affectionate, sweetest. Wake us up with like breakfast in bed, yeah. massages on our shoulders, so, kisses, hugs. Exactly. So we have to so kind of things. put up with the bad. Yeah qualities that he has because he's got also such good qualities plus we all have bad qualities I've got bad qualities but even I, our mum who's like literally incredible she's got some bad traits yeah. like really stubborn and but not like dad not like dad but no. that's why I think I felt so guilty because I feel like recently the past maybe year or two I've not I've not neglected in a way neglected yeah. him not guys don't prioritize you know, like, my mum prioritize my mum maybe not giving him as much as he deserves. As he deserves. But then, like, maybe we're giving him a really bad rap. Maybe he isn't that 
like difficult, Anna. Sometimes I think that and I spend time with him and then I'm like, oh, okay, this is why I don't spend time with him. <laughs> <laughs> he is difficult. He he's is a so diff- funny. He's difficult, but he's our dad. Guys, yeah. that's what it is. You, it's your parents. Like, it is what it is. And they've lived a long life of, you know. And sweet. looking at them should make you realize, like, don't stress about the small stuff. Mm-hmm. Don't stress about the small stuff. Like, Literally, it's nothing. It's just enjoy. We started this episode. We were gonna do this part two of things you would you would have told your younger self, but we ended up just talking away. That's so mad. Like, I know. We literally sat here and it just ended up a whole. It ended up being a catch up conversation <laughs> about catch up. Like, how mad is that? And whenever I think we might just run out of shit to say, I proved myself wrong. 